The brief for this project was basically to design individual spoon holders that would support the spoon in this kind of natural upright position. I quickly realized that I wanted to try and make a design that wouldn't obstruct your hand as you were trying to grasp the spoon, so there couldn't be an element that was supporting the handle. When I eventually came up with this idea, I really didn't know if it would work at all. Um, I ended up making quite a few prototypes before I was able to kind of distill down just the bare minimum of points of contact that you need. Another thing that makes this collection of spoons really special is that they are all what spoon carvers call bent wood spoons. That means that each of these spoons is made from a very particular bend or crook in the tree uh, so that the fibers in the wood are naturally the same shape as a spoon, making it very strong even though each spoon has a very pronounced crank. That basically means that I have to sift through my pile of wood and search for the the bends and crooks that match the shape of the spoon which is tricky when you're trying to make the spoons all more or less the same. If anyone has ever seen First Dates Ireland you'll know that pretty much everybody who comes to the door tries to pull instead of push and it's this big embarrassing moment uh, and that's bad design that handle shouldn't be there if the handle wasn't there nobody would pull everyone would just push. I know from my own personal experience selling spoons at markets that if there's a way to put the spoon back on the rack wrongly people will find it. And what that tells me above all else is that it's an imperfect spoon rack. And the nice thing about this design is that there's there's no way to pull when you should be pushing. Basically there's one way to put the spoon in, one way to take it out and you can't really do it wrongly. And that's really important in good design. <laughs>